guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica Yik, the Dancing Avon Lady, and today I want to share with you something that I've discovered. Oh, it's discovery by Jesse. No, it's not. I'm sure some other people have thought about it, but I just came across it. We've all bought lipsticks that we didn't like. The shade, whatever, blah, blah, the texture. A little while ago, I had purchased the Soft Matte Liquid Lip in Resilient, and I was thinking, oh, it'll be a nice dramatic shade, you know, I could wear it, blah, blah. I didn't end up loving it on my, on my lips, which is fine. Avon has an excellent exchange and return program on beauty products such as like lipsticks and eyeshadows and blushes, da, 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 that even if after you opened up the product, if you don't love it, you can always return or exchange it. So yay, Avon. However, I was thinking, you know, it's actually a really, really pretty color. I just don't like it on my lips. So then I was like, why don't I try it on my eyes? So I'm going to show you today the look that I've discovered by using a liquid eyeshadow on my eyes. So the funny thing is the first time I tried this was actually with our Mark Pout Velvet Lip Paint. I just, I, I bought this one for fun. Actually, I think I bought it for um, some of my dancers for a particular uh, dance we were using back then. But uh, I didn't love the shade of it on my lips either. It was, it's definitely a fun shade. It's just not really me. But if I mix it, it's kind of cool. However, this one is just, it's really dark. It's really intense. And it's a really pretty color, but it's just, it's too intense for my lips. So I took the applicator. I just put a little bit of it on my hand here, like so. And then I dab it onto my eyes. Like, look at that color. It's not a beautiful, beautiful color. Now, I just want to be careful not to go too high up because it is my darkest base color that I'm going to use it as right now. And a little bit goes a long, long way. So I just dab, 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 dab. You can probably even use a brush, but I have better control over my fingers and it's also just something I'm really used to doing and I've done it like this all the other times. Now I've already finished my foundation and my contouring and you know what? What I'm using on my face right now is actually the Magix Tints for Foundation Base and I use the Vanilla Magix Wand for my concealer, um, the chai as contour, and the marshmallows highlighting. The thing that you wanna be careful with is you wanna actually apply a very, very, very thin layer, and then don't open your eyes all the way or it will crease. The base is done. Then what I do to kind of set it, you can either use a translucent powder, or in my case, I'm gonna grab a slightly fluffy eyeshadow brush, and then I'm going to choose something a little bit lighter. So I'm gonna choose this color here and I'm just gonna sweep it along my eye. And that will help it set and not crease. It also lightens the color a bit, but it's such a beautiful base color. You can use a darker color if you want to, but I just love this color combination. So it's like almost like a champagne color on top of it. Like look how pretty that is. Isn't that so pretty? I'm not done, but it's so pretty. It's such a pretty base color and it's so nice for fall. Mm, so nice. Then for the rest of my eyes, I just finish it as per normal. So under my eyes, I'm gonna use a bit of like a khaki color. I'm also gonna mix in a little bit of the purple just to kind of complement the top. Just underneath my lash lines. And then my darker color here with my smudge brush, just in the corner here contour my eyes, give it some more shape. Then I use the other side of the brush, the liner side of the brush, same thing. And just create a soft, soft, soft line along my top lash line. What do you think? It's more dramatic now, isn't it? And then just get my fluffy brush again and just blend. Then I'm going to take my Avon White Awake liner. I just go along the underside of my brow and just near my tear ducts. Here, blend, blend. Line the under part of my eye with whatever was left over on the brush. And then, of course, 
finish it off with my favorite love of first lash mascara. I just opened this today for you guys. Actually, no, I needed to open up a new one because the other one was getting old. Oh, sound of a fresh mascara. And I'm only going to do my top lashes. And while I let that dry, I am going to do a very light lip today. My two-on-one lip tattoo in Inked Rose. Such a pretty base color. And then I'm going to just to put a little gloss on top of it today. And I'm going to use our Avon Lip Glow in Aura. And that, my friends, my makeup is done. I love this eyeshadow look. I don't usually do my eyes quite this dark. This is the final eye makeup look. And I feel like just by using that bit of powder, it, per it helps set the uh, liquid lipstick and keep it from creasing. Isn't it pretty? I love this look. Like, I legit love this look. It's so pretty. It's a really nice base color. And I would never have imagined until I tried it out that this <laughs> super dark, resilient lip lip color would be such a phenomenally gorgeous eyeshadow color. Like, I freakingly love it. It's so pretty. With that said, never be afraid to play with your makeup products. Always just play it around and find what's the best mix for you because you never know until you try it out. I mean, I would have just thrown this baby out, but you know what, now, Look at, I love it on my eyes. I've done it this a couple of times now and I redonkulously love it. It's so pretty and it's not that difficult to do and it's such a nice fall smoky-ish, like a very light smoky eye. Thank you so much for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you do click that subscribe button as well as that bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. I have new videos out every single week about my dance adventures, about Avon, uh, whether it be products, swatches, incentive, tips and tricks, da 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 da, etc, 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 and more. If you're interested in becoming a beauty boss, if you love to play with makeup, then you already will have what it takes to be a beauty boss. Make sure you contact me through my e-store link down below and I can help you get started right away to open up an online business so you can make money too while just having lots and lots of fun playing with makeup. I love you guys. See you in the next video. Bye.